I'm never getting meat out of that. Ta-da! How'd you do that? Practice, practice, practice. Oh yeah, I forgot. You cranes eat lobster all the time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hi! Gwen, what are you doing here? I'm meeting Ethan for dinner. Hi, Louise. Hey, Gwen. Hey, Gwen. Hi. Sure. Luis, I hate to interrupt, but uh, I need to talk to you alone. Police <coughs> business. Sam, I... Go ahead, Luis. It's fine. I can talk to Gwen. Okay. Good see you. What is going on? Are you on a date with Luis? Yes. <laughs> and before you say anything, yes, I remember our last conversation when you said that two people from different economic classes couldn't work, but I think long. I think it can work wonderfully. So? What's up, Sam? Someone just made a large donation to the department. A donation that will give you everything you've ever dreamed of. Well, I'm listening, Sam. What kind of donation, and how does it affect me? Well, the money's going to be spent to send a uniformed police officer to Quantico, Virginia, for a five-week training program with the FBI. That's great. Your name was mentioned by the person who donated the money. Me? That's fantastic. With that kind of training, I mean, I'll be able to make detective, sure. I know you will. I know this is what you've always wanted. Oh, man, that extra pay will mean a lot to my family. I know. Man, so why the grim look? I mean, are you worried you're going to be short-staffed while I'm gone, huh? Oh, no, that's not it. It's just the person who donated the money. It's, uh, it's Julian Crane. Julian Crane? <laughs> why would he want to do anything to help me? He's not doing it for you, Luis. He's doing it for the Cranes. I mean, this is their way of keeping you and Sheridan away from one another. I told you they'd do this. figured out exactly how to get to you. They know that your family means more to you than anything else in this world. They know by making detective that you're going to have everything you ever wanted for yourself and for the future of your family. Yeah, it would. So they're making you an offer you can't refuse. And uh, you can't refuse, can you? <laughs> 